we were approached by uh, BDRI, Bottlenose Dolphin uh, Institute in Galicia, um, and they had an, a specific need for data to be collected, uh, which they could monitor. So we were able to adapt Nemo in order to uh, produce this uh, app, which gives them the data that they need uh, for, for their reporting purposes. It's going to be used in two ways. From a scientific uh, perspective, it's going to be used to understand where the orcas are moving and how frequently they're spotted. And from a, a kind of more personal perspective, um, all boat users that go out and are currently being attacked by, by the orcas and potentially losing rudders and having a pretty nasty experience, it's going to help to separate uh, uh, man and beast. Before Christmas, uh, the, a boat was sunk. The evidence from the scientists that, that know uh, about this, you know, you know, more than I could possibly know, suggests that this is actually play. And is, they are just very large animals that can do a lot of damage to our, to our vessels and even sink them. And uh, with regards to the orcas that are nearby in the strait, the pod that moves through the strait, uh, how is this... Uh this pod doing at the moment? It's a small pod of about 11 to 15 individuals is my understanding of it uh, and, and what they're doing is that they're just adapting their behaviour uh, to feed uh, in a more effective way and the uh, attacks on the boats is a play behaviour where they're honing their skills to attack what they typically eat here which is the tuna. Um, so, so that's where we're getting these interactions from and that's why the advice given is to stop your boat because if you stop your boat it's, it, you're not running away from them anymore and and so the the idea is is that they're going to get bored and they're going to leave you alone so uh, you've mentioned that this uh, app has been rolled out in spain uh, endorsed as well by the junta de galicia so the Junta de Galicia have actually paid for the development of the app and we've worked uh, locally with MGI Limited who've helped us uh, get the app out as quickly as possible because after the incident where the ship was sunk there was a huge requirement to be seen to be doing something and so this is when we were approached by BDRI in order to, to fast track the app so uh, a massive thanks to MGI Limited to, to have helped us uh, get, get this through the door. With respect to the rollout um, what the Junta uh, have done is they have actually pushed this app uh, in a poster form to all the ports in Spain so it's been released nationally in Spain um, as a way of getting as many people as possible to use it and to hopefully collect as much data as, as possible so that we can then start doing some useful stuff with that.